Arizona Congressman Andy Biggs sounds the alarm on the need for border security funding as Democrats continue to focus their efforts on the Mueller report and taking down the president. One America's Neil McCabe has more from Washington. The new chairman of the House Freedom Caucus, Arizona Republican Congressman Andy Biggs, told One American News, Democrats on Capitol Hill are focused on one thing, taking down President Donald Trump. They're flat out obsessed with attacking the president. The Freedom Caucus has been there uh, all along, and that's it's not part of our charter statement or anything, but what our charter statement was is to give voice to the, to the people of this country uh, who feel like they don't have a voice in Congress. Big succeeds Ohio Republican Congressman Jim Jordan, the founding chairman, and the second chairman, North Carolina's Mark Meadows. The Freedom Caucus has roughly 30 members, and it is the conservative bloc inside the House Republican Conference. President Trump was elected to try to drain the swamp, and that means that the Freedom Caucus also can participate in draining that swamp. And, and if that means uh, stepping in the breach and trying to protect this president, then that's not a bad thing. Biggs represents Arizona's 5th Congressional District, just to the east of Phoenix. And like other border state conservatives, he said he tries to explain to congressmen from the rest of the country why the border is so important. I went from uh, all the way from McAllen, uh, all the way over to Yuma in different times to, to see different places and see board, ports of entry and in between the Big said the parts in between the ports of entry are a major problem. We have places along our border where you're not going to have a, a port of entry for many, many miles and that's wide open. In some places uh, I could take you right now and show you about 75 miles of of border with with Mexico, where it's a single strand of barbed wire. Even more absurd, the congressman said at some places, there are full steel bollard barriers, which end abruptly with a single barbed wire fence with simple unlocked entryways. A four strand barbed wire fence uh, that, that is put there and is looped on with a loop fence. If you've ever been on an old ranch, you just lift the loop, <laughs> you lift the loop up and and the fence is open. And that's, guess what? All the trails from south of the border lead right to that position where the loop, the loop gate is. Neil W. McCabe, One American News, Capitol Hill. Want to see more videos like this? Click on the link below and subscribe to One American News on YouTube. And call your cable provider and kindly demand that One American News is added to your lineup. Call and subscribe today.